Hey, hey, how are you? Good. Come on, let me introduce you to my team. A N I M A L Animal H U S B A N D A R Y Husbandary. When I got my first attack, I started losing my balance a bit. So my family obviously thought that you know. Must be because of the weakness and all. Suddenly, in the morning, one day you get up and there is no vision in the eye. Earlier times, it used to happen like this. Okay, suddenly you get up and your legs start stop moving. It was actually the third attack which hit me very badly because it had affected my speech. I was talking in very long pauses, like you know, hello. How are you? First, they told me it's transverse myelitis in the first attack, but later in the second attack, they said it's multiple sclerosis. When I talk to somebody what MS is, I just explain it in simple words. It's like this uh, electric wire which has a coating on it. So whenever this wire, the coating is ruptured, and whenever such two electric wires come together, there's a shock circuit type of thing. That's what MS is. Like the nerves are the wires, electric wires. So whenever the myelin coating of these nerves ruptures, and whenever two such nerves come in contact with each other, that portion of your body goes numb. Suppose if I have to pick up anything with a spoon, I can't do that. I can't lift the spoon to my mouth. It becomes difficult. See, my right eye has no vision. It's a complete blackout. Left eye has a little vision, which is a 10 to 15 percent. So if you combine both the eyes, vision no means if I'm looking at you, so I can't see there's somebody standing here. I can see her. But nothing else. If it's some one lakh fifty thousand is written, if I can't see the one, I only calculate it as fifty thousand. Whenever I get the attack, it's like I feel like my head is spinning inside. I'm just not even able to sit straight. I would just fall down. You know, it this could happen any time, anywhere. In that period, my spine was been affected. My eyesight was totally gone. Then I took a decision: I'm going to quit the job. बस में ट्रेन में बैठने को जगह नहीं मिले तो तकलीफ हो जाती है इसके लिए मैं बहुत कम ट्रैवल करना पसंद करती हूँ पब्लिक ट्रांसपोर्टेशन में एंड द थिंग इज़ कि मुझे देख के कोई मुझे हैंडी कैप तो समझेगा नहीं और मुझे जगह देगा नहीं बैठने के लिए लेकिन मेरा फटीक मुझे मालूम है और मैं खड़ी नहीं रह पाती हूँ आई नीड टू सेट इमीडिएटली सो इन फैक्ट When I'm traveling with my family or friends or whomsoever, सो पहले वो लोग मुझे बैठने की जगह देते बोलते भैया तू बैठ जा तू गिर गई तो प्रॉब्लम हो जाए Slowly, slowly. 
Is that okay? Don't fall on your head, huh? Yeah? Alright, enough. I can't do it, you are like this. Go, go. Hurry, go. My friends stopped talking to me. They, in fact, even told me on my face, you irritate us. And I had my colleagues imitating me. Yeah, I want you guys to taste my hand. That's when I googled on the net and I got MS Society's uh, address and I did not tell anybody in my house and I just went there on my own. Then post that the MS Society helped me out by offering me a job in their NGO. I worked there for about six months and that helped me in gaining my confidence. My husband also never lets me feel that way, that I'm a burden on him, you know. You feel that you can't go anywhere, you need them to take you here, take you there. But they have never let me feel like that. Everybody has someone or the other in their lives. You do feel lonely. You feel like there is nobody for you. You are all by yourself. You don't have that one person to whom you can call up anytime, shout at him, love him. I feel better, I am there, you know, something is going around me. I feel a little bit relaxed. I mean, in the world, I am existing. That's a little bit of a drink. I'm going to go to the 
समुद्राचा एवढा पाण्याचा आवाज येत नाही तुला माझ्या फोन वर कर मग तुला आवाज देईल स्पीकर वर लावतो ती काढते ना I do not hide my illness at all. In fact, I am very upfront about it and I tell people that yes, I have MS. But in spite of me having that illness, I am doing all the things that I want to do in life. I got this software, I got the JAWS, I have, uh, now I can operate on PC. I am taking tuitions, the knowledge I am distributing, I am happy with it. I can see properly with both my eyes. That statement I pass every day, morning, evening, night. You know, I can see and I'm fine. There are problems. So I don't want to stick with the problems. I want solutions. Fight it out. Say that you will live with it and you will live it happily and boldly. Without it affecting you. Don't ever quit. Crawl if you have to to the finish line but don't quit. <laughs>